I'm talking about. So this justice is not just for Mobad. Mobad is late. But there's, I'm telling you, read my lips today. There's some young artists who are passing through a lot, more than what Mobad is, what, uh, what, uh, was passing through when he was alive. <sighs> so by the time that we finally get justice for Mobad, those guys can be able to come out. Mm. Those guys can be able to withdraw because mm. some of them they have cheap, they have pinned those guys down, both boys <coughs> and ladies. They have pinned them down with their mm. oath and other things. You will see that people they right to come close. So let them do something that will suppose those guys. Nobody is late, but what about the people that are coming, the young artists that are coming up? <coughs> what about the young artists that are coming up? Are we talking about? Are we thinking about them? Oh, well, then, or, no. or is it because the J justice from the back? The J, the J, the J, the J, the J, the J, the J Naira Mali, or J Samlari, or J Wumi, any of them, they will not die there, everything died there. What about the other guy that is crying from another corner there? I'm very glad that a lot of people have taken time to make use of social media positively. And people are beginning to see deeper than the shallow thinking of others. I mean, some thought it's only about justice for Mubad and SARS and all of that, uh, you know, scream and narrative. But people are beginning to think deeper, like, hold on a second. What happened to Mubad? The behavior of human being in general, depending on the locality they belong to or they live in, it says a lot. What are the norms? What are the things that we have accepted? What are the things that people will cover up? It is sad. Very sad. Very sad. I want you to listen more. I mean, let us listen to this from the beginning of the video to the end of it. And we'll be doing more analysis. I mean, this is explosive. This is explosive. And people are beginning to dig deeper into this justice. And they do not want to stand and end at this justice. The one who press for that, I think it's applaudable. People are beginning to understand that if we do not deal with internal issues, if we do not deal with ourselves, if we do not look in words, how then do you think you want to better your country? How then do you think you will know what to demand from your government or from any institution that surrounds you? Are you the kind of person that will applaud your brother, a police officer, who is a criminal, who has shot a lot of people because they didn't give him money on the street? Are you the kind of person that will call your brother to go and, you know, brutalize other people because he's in the army and you want to muscle on them? These are the little things we should begin to look at. Slowly, you begin to understand that... It is not just about the law, it's about the implementation of it. Let us listen to this one. So what I want you, what I want you to do, and I want each and every one of us in this platform, that come on this platform to do, uh, Papa oh, Yano, my goodness. get on WhatsApp. Guys, welcome to Lady J's Corner. Share if you haven't shared, subscribe and join. follow. That one is, it's very hard for them, for those evil, to... Uh, to, uh, to hear our voice or do you to try think, to give information. Do you, do, do you think oh, we, we can really get rid of evil guys? If you, ah, really you, think if, you can do that. Even if you cannot, even if you cannot get Hello? rid of them, but you can stop some of their plan. You can stop some of their plan. <laughs> Mr. Pumba, anyway, I will call, that's a very good idea, okay, but uh, it's a very, very good idea. Honestly speaking, I welcome that and I appreciate that very, very much. And we will see to it, but uh, it's very difficult to fight a political fight like that because that is a fight of the state now, like, you know, like an activist, you know. So uh, those who who's gone down this path, what is their history in this country? And um, yes, I mean, it's a good thing, but I know one thing for sure, that whenever, whenever, whenever I want to do anything, I sit down, I decide it comes from within. And I look at how much resources I have to back it up. Just like when I decide to come to be coming online, you know how well it's expensive. You know how data is forever. So I will waste. I will have my own investment in it. Put my own money in it. Be doing it. Then anybody who feel like to support along the way can support. Then that's the reason why people don't embarrass my stuff. 
is because with them or without them, I can always keep it going. That's the difference. But sometimes when you decide to work with people, okay, and you are not you are not ready yourself, you are not set up yourself, a lot of nonsense will come from it, believe me. Papa, Papa Rano, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Even if you are trying to do what I'm, I, what I ask you to do now, government will be involved. Do you think? Are you trying to tell me that the government are talking about everybody in the government are bad? No, we have good people there too. We have good people in the government, and the government there too. So when you start this, government will be involved. You, you won't know. Government will be involved, believe me. How do you differentiate okay. between the good government okay. and bad government? Let me tell you, let me tell you, let me tell you, okay, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. In the history of this country, Mubad was the first Nigerian musician or artist that the House of Representatives gave a three minute silence for. Go and check. That's fact. Me? That's fact. Yeah. <laughs> Mubad was the first was the first Nigerian artist, musician, that the House of Representatives give a three-minute silence for. Are you trying to tell me that even in that place, no good, no good people among them, if there is no good people among them, who take this case up to that, to that level? <coughs> no, it's a who very beautiful idea. Up to that level? Yeah. It's a very beautiful idea. So, but at the end of the so, day, so what I'm trying to tell you, and at the point, at the point, at the at the point, at the point, at the point, let me tell you something. At the point, you won't believe. You will say one day you will say, Kai, this guy, tell him. Okay, well, that's one thing I will never do. Okay, the reason why I will not do it because I know the people I'm working with. I know Nigerians. I'm a Nigerian, and I know how a typical Nigerian thinks. First, before I deal with people, I want to know how they reason, how they how they think. Okay. If it is healthy for them, I want to do it. But if I know how it's going to always be, then I have to apply caution. Okay? People do not understand. Nigerians are technically one of the smartest people in the world. You have to be very, very careful. Nigerians are not just sheep. Okay? The same way they come to help you, the same way they can turn their back on you in an instant. Okay? So if you're not in that level of preparation, avoid Nigerians. If you are not in that level, they have already so much problem that they want to deal with. And these problems requires people who are ready mentally, spiritually, health-wise. Okay? So, there is all these ones. Everybody's complaining. Nigeria is not good. Nigeria is not good. Nigeria is not good. Give them. Just because I'm speaking English or because I'm speaking here does not mean I'm ready to do some certain things. Okay, so now mm, it is very good. No, no, it is very good that at the end of the day we try people, all right. But one thing we will not do will not push people. What is good when the time of what is good comes, it will it will be established. It will come without even anybody <coughs> bringing the idea. It will just come naturally. Believe me. I mean, I have always studied growth the way growth works. Real growth that lasts. It comes in a way that you don't even know how it starts. Like I said initially, I said, I am glad that more people are engaging on this. And by so doing, they will be able to speak to their inner man, inner woman. They will be able to prick their conscience, their consciousness. Because there are a lot of things that people have um, accepted, embraced. They see these things as norm. They see it as a way of life, particularly if it concerns their... Um, their own family members, they are someone from their tribe, someone from their region, someone who is in their own religion, they tend to kind of want to cover up and act and pretend like everything is fine. Just look at the way they started attacking the father of Mubad as if they love Mubad more than his father. They said the man is only after property and I'm kind of wondering, is he after the property of his wife or is after the well-being, welfare, estate of his own son? Like, seriously, when has it become a sin? When has it become a crime? Oh, he's only good for the corpse of his son. But any other thing? No, 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 no. He should... Ma I'm kind of wondering, maybe all of these people talking gave birth to Mobad. All of a sudden, the man should be sidelined. I don't know if the man has been cursed or 
It is the curse of poverty. Because if it were a popular musician like Davido, whose father is rich and is also extremely rich, the narrative would have been different. It would have been different. People would have spoken differently. They would not say, oh, Davido's father is only after this and that. If the man had been interested in his son's affair and welfare. People said a lot of things. So, it's a good thing that people are engaging. And people also are not dumb, sentimental, emotional, trying to cover up Wumi, the wife of Mubad. That people have tagged black widow, wicked widow, and all of that. Why? Because all through, she presented a statement at the inquest, corona inquest, and she didn't say nothing. She didn't really say anything that makes sense. She's either not there when Mubad was having issues with his friend. She's either not there when Mubad slumped. She was never in any place where Mubad was. She never experienced or witnessed or nothing. She didn't even witness the... The, 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 the hug of Mubad from the way she's speaking. Like, no, 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 no. I, I was not there. I was cooking jollof rice. I was cooking fried rice. No, I went to call the bouncer. No, I was on the bike, the motorbike. No, I was not there. I was not here. And I wo wo observed that she made sure that her face was not shown on camera when they were in the SUV, when those guys screamed and said that Mubad is gone. I observed all of this. She removed herself from it. She totally excluded herself from everything she's only interested in telling us about mubat's father how he brought his um, woman friend to their house not the one that is with him now another one and i'm like what's wrong with this girl's mind is she not normal we are asking you to tell us the things that we don't know about mubat we are not interested in mubat's father's uh, uh, personal life we want to know you you your whole life after all We've asked for DNA. Why did we ask? Because you requested for donation. Go fund me. You requested. And people started bringing funds. And we also know that you have a Canadian visa that you confirmed at the corona inquest. So when we say you wanted to run away, it is true. If not that we said it, you would have disappeared. But this will not go. So I'm glad that people are kind of engaging in the conversation. They say it's not only about Mobad. There are other people involved. There are other people who are having issues that... Um, and with this, we will prick our, our, our inner self, our emotion. We will prick that thing inside of us. That thing that makes you a bad person. That thing that makes you evil, wicked. And if you want to, well, we have the correctional center that will deal with you. That's the truth. So what are your thoughts about this one? Drop your comment, like, and share. See you in the next update.